All right. This might work. We'll see. Um, don't know what happened here. Just gonna kill my teammates somehow. But we'll get the next one. But yeah, um, I need these two for the logbook still. They're the last ones I need. He's gone. terrible so basically i've gotten everything in the book except for this this and a lot of the long ammo weapons because they're expensive and i don't like them in the first place um there's the single big wind field and then everything else and i also gotta get three percent for the carabiner but for the most part uh my goal today is going to be getting these done which uh to make them a little more usable I have levering for the terminus, which will make it shoot faster if I don't aim in with it, which is a shotgun I shouldn't be doing. Um, I put penny shot on it so it does more damage in close range. And uh, for the um, Spectre Compact, which is the one up there, uh, I put slugs on it to make it um, have a lethal kill range of at least 10 meters so it's usable as a shotgun if I have to aim it because it's no longer buckshot, so it's a slug, you know? <laughs> An adventure, which I haven't even got a chance to test my aim today, because um, the only game I played, my teammates refused to. Um, well, they refused to let me fight the enemies because they forced us out into the open against people with long ammo, and I got shot by the first person I saw. I'm hoping OBS is recording my uh, audio. It may not. Who cares? Nice gun you got there, buddy. Good, 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 good. Just don't get shot. It's that easy. Just shoot the bad guys before they shoot you. Here I go, getting shot. Shot in the head, any percent speed run. Fancy me here. Well, I am terrified that there's going to be a sniper out there. I'm amazed you had the gall the, the go to stand there outside.
blades. I want to pick up my blades with the... Uh, every second I stand here, second I'm nice to go ahead approach and see me. Thank you. The rest of them fell through. Fantastic. Oh, and I can't grab them because they're in the floor. Also fantastic. Okay. Some down three of these. Yeah, so uh, a large part of this game is avoiding the um, sound cues, like crows and stuff, which my teammates set off just now. So um, now enemies, if they were paying attention, could have seen those crows flying away, and if they're close enough, they could have heard them, um, which is not good. Not good at all. But um, well, we'll see how it goes. Once we banish him, which is the uh, ritual that actually kills him and uh, moves him to the next game, I suppose, um, it uh, gives back all the health. And right now, I'm playing a dangerous game where if I get shot at by someone who has a long ammo rifle, they just kill me. So. The hope is that none of those people show up. I also might try to steal this kill. that I can't use because I am using special ammo, that being the penny shot and the slugs. So I'm 90% sure that just went into the water down there, so I'm down with another one. Pretty much. Um, so as a result, uh, I'm not reloading my guns because these two in particular will both lose a shot whenever I um, reload unless I have a perk that gets rid of that function of that the thing up here. Shot. I hope this will give me more uh though, at least. Um there's some special ammo. I feel a lot more I wanted to close the door so I can but I'm still uh, I'm still loading full ammo. I wanna get fully up on ammo. as far as possible, right? Still gonna do it. Still gonna do it. Just 
doesn't seem to be any medkits around here. See what I can do about flanking these suits. Maybe I can catch them trying to flank around here. Mm -hmm. Though that one's a little more on my way. I didn't know he was out of range of the slugs. I definitely thought the slugs were within range of him. That's an enemy! Holy crap! That was her face I was seeing there. I'm dead. <laughs> I was like, what is that shape? <laughs> oh, my teammate's probably gonna die there. Good. Oh no, he got one. Just not have next one answer. Yikes. He's using an uppercut though, so. Ooh, and he's using sneaky angles. This is a gamer, right here. That's it, for sure. So, I thought I was gonna bleed him through the walls, because that's what frag grenades do. She backed way up. He should have had one. Considering her position behind that mound. Oh, nope, she's on her way up now. Ooh! Snapshot. Good shot on him. I think that's it. I think it was only a duo. I haven't heard any other steps, but he, he's probably going to take precautions just in case. I didn't see a third. They might have, but... Just a duo. He has the bounty. What? I didn't even know that the bounties were ready. Why is he going for my teammate instead of me? Okay. Whatever. Thank you. What is going on here? I don't know. Cover me while I get this guy. Okay. me and the water devil's gonna come kill me. I can't believe that was her face that I was seeing through that crack. That's so hilarious. There might just only be two. 
Nah, dude, I, I tagged one. Did I, did I kill this guy over here? The one in the water? I'm... You headshot her, yes. Oh, did I? Oh. Yes. I thought I didn't kill that dude. All right, all right, that makes more more sense. Okay. No, no, she's dead as hell. Oh, yeah, yeah, she's dead. She's hell dead. Oh, I hear birds. I think people are coming. This would not surprise me. We have no convenient extracts, so I would like to show Yeah, we're gonna have to stay here. Right? I'm gonna chill on this side. I gotta use my shotguns to my advantage. And by the way, the reason that I didn't try shooting that guy through the wall with this one is because Penny Shot has no penetration power. Only the slugs do, and slugs require me to aim, so I can't really reliably just shoot at people through walls with them. I honestly probably could have gotten away with trying to shoot that guy through the crack as well instead of pushing him, but I just was not sure that I would get away with that. Ooh, doggies. They're coming from the same side that team did. I like to hear that. <laughs> this is such a sneaky little spot. <laughs> okay, let's see what we can do here. Alright, 15 minutes into the mission. 40 my 45 left. But yeah, the thing I was talking about with the frag bombs. Uh, if I were to throw this, like, right there, I would still get hit with the shrapnel of it, and it would cause me to bleed. It wouldn't do much damage, but that is enough to force me to bandage the bleeding. And once I'm bandaging bleeding, someone can push me. Which is why I... It's usually what people run instead of the dynamites, which are overall better for just outright killing people. I wouldn't be surprised if both teams are going to push at the same time. That would be a uh, crescendo of madness, which is unusual, or not unusual for this game. So. Oh, they're fighting each other. Sick. I hope they're fighting each other anyway. Maybe that was a chaos bomb. Maybe I'd just been baited out all along, and I'm going to fucking die here. Yep, I thought I saw enemies there. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. Alright. So they're not fighting each other, and uh, that was a chaos bomb from the other side. Or some uh, decoys, which is kind of smart. My issue comes from the fact that um, I am now out of position. Well, I'm not out of position against enemies that don't know I'm here, but now that they know I'm here, I have to move. These guys don't know what they are, though. I don't think my teammate's alone up there. Yo, can you scan for me real quick? Yeah, so they're here. There's three people, looks like. They're fanned out. There's one at 240. One at 285 and one at 345. Yeah, there's one behind the mm -hmm. Yeah, he's a phantom dude. And there's somebody straight ahead in the trees somewhere. I don't know, it's probably not going to be uh, with that stuff there. <laughs> The other one is where the, the animals are. I don't need to watch this anymore. Anyway. My slugs will not reach light. that. On the Spectre, full sized? Maybe. But the compact? Uh, very un unlikely. I don't know. I just can't shake the feeling that I heard something. Like that. But it's just like. I can't force them to stand. So once someone gets a token, by the way, they get that little orange hand effect that that guy did earlier in their dark sight. Mine doesn't have it, but theirs do. They, uh, for five seconds, when they use that, they can see enemies through walls. 
It takes them out of their gun. It's fair. It helps make it so that we can actually have a chance to escape without them just hunting us down. This guy in 240 is going to make a whole ass flank this way, I think. I'm just waiting to see him. I'm going to push a little closer to him. And will likely die as a result. I don't know where he is. He could have already made it to that tree line and be going around. I don't know. But I do know that it is my job as the person not on the map and having a bounty token. Because once you have a bounty token, you are visible to all other players in the map. Um, and their dark side will do this little lightning thing you might have seen on mine earlier. Um... As the person without a bounty token, it's my obligation to do any kind of sneaky flanks because otherwise they will get seen with points against wood. Without being seen, if you get me. By observant enemies, you are just not going to get a flank with a bounty. Phantom guy shooting me from the greenhouse in the back of it. Okay. <sighs> I see them now. They stood still, so I could not originally. Really? From that distance? You really trying your luck with that? I'll try my luck. Mine's got slugs though. <laughs> this phantom worries me. He can two shot me if he's lucky. That pistol. Seems like they're using shotguns. Ooh! Stop doing this. Fuckers in the trees, man. It's just like Vietnam. It's just like Vietnam. It's just like Vietnam. I need you to scan. I need a scan. sake of the win, I might be able to take that. I'm gonna do it. This guy's using his spring fields. I have to get closer. The issue with that is that I don't know exactly where he's at, and he could just pop out from a tree with like a hand cannon or something. But I am obligated to get closer before he does. 
because his gun out outrange is mine. Even though I swapped to a uh, an actual gun with ranged options. I'm just not seeing this man. I don't know. He's, he's, he's somewhere in this fucking compound now. Uh, I can't revive my teammates because one of them gets red skulled if he goes down again and the other one has no help. I'll just go down in the first shot. Especially if this guy's watching it from like a bush or some shit. Because people love to play like that in this game and I really don't like that. He's in a bush over there. He's just standing in a bush. I guarantee it. <sighs> okay. I either take the longest flank of my life or I try to res my teammates. And I don't like either option. Um, or... Here's an idea. Burn that body. So in this game, burning bodies uh, gets rid of health bars. Um, if they're downed, and that will force this guy to come to me a little faster, which my teammates probably don't know what the hell I was just doing, to be honest, but I know, I just don't know where this guy is, I need him to push, maybe that gets him moving, maybe it doesn't, who knows. See you. Okay. Go, move, move, move. Get out of sight. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, okay. Now we're making some progress towards this guy. He has to come closer to us, and I got a teammate. Alright. My teammate's gonna go for that res. I can feel it. Oh no, he's pushing. 50 health? Uh, I will join. <sighs> got a Springfield. Let's just push. He's got a one shot weapon. which I totally understand, but if she gets Red Skull, our teammate with the bounty can revive her. So that they don't become a nuisance later. Let's move on. I keep getting closer. The only solution to be beating this guy is to uh, <coughs> get him my optimal range while staying out of his. Okay, 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 it's fine. No more healing after this. And my teammate just walked into range of his pistol and got one shot because uh, it does 50 damage and she had 50. Yes. 
now is the part where a third team just comes in and shoots me while I'm doing this. Would not surprise me. Alrighty. Sorry for not reviving you sooner. I got no words for what just occurred here. You got a bounty, right? You can run. No, you have to. I don't have it. Wait, where's the other bounty? He's got it. You can't pick a bounty from dead teammates. I think, anyway. He died. Right. Yeah, unfortunately, that's why this game can take so long. Because people play like that, and it's really not fun. They make the game unfun. I mean, it's tense. But that's not the fun kind of tension I'm looking for. Like, I, I... If we lost that, that would have just been frustrating. Not fun. There was no no enjoyment in chasing that rat down, you know? <laughs> I want to I wanna loot him. Oh, he's already been looted. Gotcha. Alright, well, we should be good to leave. I don't know why anyone else would be waiting for us anywhere, but... You still require healing. Let's see this. I'll heal him. I'll heal him. Alright. Let's go, Wes. Okay. Well, picking up that, uh... That windfield really saved the day for us. <laughs> Uh, unfortunately, it's not for the logbook, but, you know, I don't care. A win's a win towards my, uh, my goal for today. <laughs> this is two bounties here. My goal for today is nine, which is a weird number, but whatever. And I'll probably get this uploading at some point later. I'll just keep this one as a recording. Yeah, but like, it, the thing about that guy, the way he was playing, is that as a result of not knowing where he was, like, I have to make so many, like, dangerous movements to ascertain his whereabouts. It makes stealth play in this game really good, but unfun. Like, it's just, it's just sitting there playing Vietnam Simulator. This time, we were fortunate. Other times, not so much. No, we made it work. I can't believe I didn't die to that guy with the, the, the bear hat there. Like, that should have been game. That, that I should have traded with that guy, and then we should have lost. He grazed me with something. Probably. It's it's pretty likely that he was just using a normal specter and managed to hit an arm shot instead of a chest shot like I did. I mean, I'm fortunate to be alive. Not for real. Where is that meathead? I believe him to be on the other side. Oh, you know what I can do? I don't even need to use a fucking explosive. I got a penny shot on a hand cannon. Nah, uh, maybe not. He's too far. And I'm too lazy. That's way. Onward. That's how you make the hand cannon actually do damage. Hey man, I got progress towards my uh, Spectre there too. I got progress towards both weapons actually. I killed the bear guy with this. Suit. Another chance of uh, killing the bear with this. 
allow me to give it a shot. <laughs> More like a few shots. They're gonna just extract, so I need to be on there with them, or they will extract without me, which is super lame, but... five <laughs> or no sorry that's one game of at least three and a half i guess or no two and a half sorry well at this point it has to be three because now i need seven more so it could conceivably to be two more if i'm fortunate but um it's more than likely that i won't get two bounties in both of my next games, and also extract with both, so, you know. Right. Any chance I got that thing for the book? For the book? Oh, I did not. Uh, this is painful. <laughs> I hate using these guns, I really do. I mean, I can move on to something and finish something else off, but just, I want to get the medium things done and then just have to use my primary, free up both slots for myself. I mean, this guy is just for fun at this point, right? Yeah, I think I'm going to retire him. Ah, but he's got so many good traits. He will do acceptably as a... Uh, Spectre and um, Terminus Slave. <laughs> Spectre will have push ups this time. Um, since I don't have levering, um, I'm putting uh, the hand cannon in first slot with the slugs because levering is the thing that allowed me to shoot the, the shots at the end there so rap rapidly. Otherwise, it's super slow and clunky, and I'm just going to use the slugs to make it manageable. This flechette makes enemies bleed. It's like a secondary to my secondary weapon, which is my primary weapon, because they're both secondary weapons, and I'm using them actively as primaries. <laughs> I don't want a regen shot, so I can have some healing. And uh, this time, I don't have to worry about the reload thing, because now I got bullet rubber on this guy. He's got Lightfoot, Termination Greyhound. Yeah, he's good. Okay. And, uh, yeah, I think we're going to get into harder games now. Uh, that one, I think, was with a bunch of four stars. Yeah. I, I shift between four and five stars. And because I performed well in that game by killing three people, I'm going to have to play against the five stars again. They are a lot tougher, and they tend to be good at shooting people. That guy with the Springfield there, he had plenty of opportunities to kill all of us, and he missed shots because he's not skilled. <laughs> um, in 5-star, you don't get away with just running at him like I did. Well, you can if you do it together, but my teammate uh, <laughs> did not. <laughs> she, she ran in from his side uh, while I was healing like I could help her and then got shot as a result so that happens I should probably where's my phone
I can't type. There we go. Gotcha. What? I was gonna hit her in the chest and then I was gonna try to melee her with my guns for the XP, but um whatever. It's weird to have these reversed. I think we should go to lower. Face, which is this straight right here. So, um, it didn't matter if I can get a throwing axis, so I dealt with that horse there. Otherwise, that horse would scream out whenever we got too close and then uh, he would hear it. Which, even with Beast Face, it would get a bit of it out, but I would melee it before it could uh, properly get it all out. Sick 50 50, let's go! Come on, there we go. Actually, I want this one to go on the upstairs one. Concertino, or you can put bear traps in concertino mines, but not vice versa. Hello? And my teammates are fighting right now. I'm not going to participate this time. I don't have anything that would be useful except for my knife. And while that's cool, it's cooler to be safe and have a teammate watching while the rest of them fight. So yeah, a thing that I never really mentioned about this game is that um, there are two bounties, right, on this map. We are at the smaller one. This will yield less rewards, but it's easier to find. The main issue right now is that these are the extraction points, and uh, <laughs> we are not near them. And if we start this, we will for sure have to go through the other area, the other bounty, like at least the territory of it, which drastically increases the odds of the, uh, the enemy teams deciding to come for us. Hey, so what's the thoughts on uh, leaving this one and going to the second bounty and just going ahead and doing that? Um, it's up to you. There's no extraction right down for that. Because the extractions really suck. Unless we can clear the map, we're probably going to have a bad time. Let's just start at Fisher. Uh, or PvP the better. Now there is a chance, right, however small, that someone uh, goes into that and finds that we aren't there and takes the bounty. We are hoping that doesn't happen, but um, if it does, we can semi-easily catch them. I do not have dusters. I need this emulator killed, please. Thank you. Uh, 
Stop there. Let my teammate didn't see them. I was just playing them for him, but I didn't think to do so. That's okay now. Whose horse was that? to maintain some stealth here. You said towards the shots? Whoa, whoa, whoa. I'm gonna die. Oh fuck, oh fuck, oh fuck. This is just a bad idea to beat them like that. I'm just asking to get my head blown off. My teammates got a decent flank on them already. That guy down there. still shooting at something, so it must be this way. Where? There we go. Alright, good work, man. Good flank, even if you lost a life. It's not a duo. There's that. Going all the way to King Snake. Ugh. Um, I put Concertino on the body of the other one. If you guys go to loot him, so try not to walk into it. Okay, yeah, that's all right. Because it was only a duo that we saw, but you know. No, it was a trio. I killed. I killed all three. Or I killed two. Uh, I didn't kill anybody, I don't know if I can do it, but... Yeah, yeah. I had killed two. And he killed the third. I don't know, that Avto is going to be really fun to fight. Can't wait. Yeah. <laughs> so the Avto, uh, which is pronounced that way even though, you know, some people would think that it's pronounced Auto, um... Is the only automatic weapon in the game. And, uh, it fires long ammo, which means that it does about, eh, 
115 to 120 damage a shot if it hits you in the body at 10 meters, which is like maybe there. So that's fun. I don't know if my teammate is down a large or small bar, the one that went down. He had three bars remaining. Ugh, the odds are probably he's down a large bar, which means he's probably at about 100 health, which is not a good thing. This is such a nightmare. This is such a terrible place to push in general. Uh, at least that guy's using an Aptos, so he would probably be holding close range. The thing is, like, extremely unwieldy. To the point that using it at range is probably a, just gonna get you killed. I'm gonna get hit by that. I did not get hit by that. Still the Apto. Apto is still alive. Apto is still alive. Do not push. I see him. Over here. <laughs> Just had to tell my teammates not to push because otherwise they will. <laughs> She's alive. Peace. Got him. Nice. The Apto. The, was the first guy using an Apto with a fucking conversion and not an uppercut? Oh, no. He, he was. What a weirdo. Alright. Good work. Man, now we gotta go back and get that bounty. <laughs> it's only a little bit of walking, man. This guy just walked into one of their own traps, by the way. Very funny. Really? Right there, yeah. That's funny. Thank you for saving me against that uh, crown and king, by the way. All right. I'm going to the resupply at Weeping Mill. Gotcha, gotcha. We made that work, man. <laughs> I fully expected us to lose this fight because that guy was down a health bar, but they focused on me and they just kept missing shots. So, you know, I will take it. <laughs> like, I'm alive. I did not even go down. I don't know how. <laughs> Whatever, man. I'll take it. You're supposed to be at six today? Sick. <laughs> I mean, we're, there's a team missing, but I would assume the aftermath was shooting because it was shooting at a human being. Because uh, long ammo bullets, even for the aftermath, which goes through them exceedingly fast, because it has 16 bullets in a clip and it shoots three round burst. Or, well, the smallest you can shoot in automatic is three round bursts. Or you can just hold down the trigger and it will fire it, you know, the whole way through. But, um, what was I trying to say? Uh, it, it, it's hard to resupply bullets with, because it's long ammo. Long ammo doesn't usually resupply extremely fast, because it is uh, a very powerful 
that's the way of nerfing it. Like, uh, the less powerful a gun's ammo is, the more bullets it's given to compensate for, you know, the fact that your bullets will not do as much damage. But you're still probably better off using long ammo in this game, metal-wise. But, well, I don't do that, so. <laughs> I use medium ammo, usually, which is, uh... It usually fires around the uh, 400 meters per second mark, whereas long ammo is about 600-ish. I'm just better whenever I'm leading my targets. Like, practically hit scan in this game fucks with my mind so much. I, don't, I can't explain it. I'm just so much better with a, a medium ammo weapon than a long one, which is why they are nowhere in my logbook. Um, I don't know if that was uh, quite visible earlier, but... Uh, I just do not use the long ammo weapons. They are expensive, and for me, they are pretty overpriced, purely because I just have had with them, so I usually just take them in, lose them, and then cry about it, and then move on. So. You good? not load the four shot. Oh, it's got a fourth one in it. It's just being baby about it. I don't know that I can even kill that emulator conceivably, even with all my fish out rounds. So, uh, I'm gonna be a sensible human being. This is I don't know if he'll come through it. That may get him to come this way now. Let's see. If I get a hit marker here whenever he goes through it, then yes, it did. Which that emulator, by the way, the way they work is uh, their skin is pierced, not being with bullets or a knife melee. Um, then they will do that big old fire explosion that guy did, and that will take away a small health bar in one. So, uh, not very fun. Which I believe I have a small health bar up front here, so we'll find out here. Exactly damage, yeah. Which the health chunks there, the bottom, they are randomized. Generally, I try to keep um, small bars in front because a bar is taken whenever you go down. And, you know, uh, that's more forgiveness. Even though the AI becomes more punishing, uh, the, the idea is just um, do that and then get good. <laughs> and uh, be resistant to uh, AI fuckery, which um, is hard because this game can... Uh, really just decide that you die if it really wants to. It can just throw, like, a million, uh, special infected at you if it wants to. But, you are sort of expected to be, um, wary of that. You know, you're supposed to look around, use your eyeballs. A series of good decisions, this game. I'd like to see it. I think one of my teammates probably took that after this guy did, yeah. <laughs> the uh, aftermath, by the way, uh, part of its balancing, being the only automatic weapon and, you know, long ammo, is that it costs uh, 1,200 hunt points, which I will show how much I made after this with two bounties. It might just be enough for an aftermath. That is not counting equipment, um, tools... Like, it, it doesn't count, like, my knife, first aid kit, all this jazz. All of my three through zero on the keyboard. And you have to have a secondary, which is generally, like, almost required to be an uppercut, which is the only long ammo pistol in the game. 
and that thing is 275 hunt coins, so if you're running the app, so you're probably spending 1500 just for the loadout of your guns. That is not counting um, tools or anything. They will shoot an area, so. I'm loading a whole ass of oil on a horse. So little damage. It's because these are expected to do bleed rounds, or bleeding. So they, you know, the rounds are weaker to compensate. But, um. <coughs> AI doesn't take bleeding damage, only human players do, so, you know, it really kind of limits your, uh, use against the AI while making it, um, in theory particularly effective against players, because it does extend the reach of the shotguns quite a bit, but in my experience, at least on the hand cannons, the shots are just not super worth it. The only time I've had success with them is when I put them on a levering terminus. Because it cannot put shotgun rounds quite fast if you have levering on it. But that was on a full size terminus with levering. So the full size terminus is about 270 hunt coins. So that's not particularly cheap, you know? It is the second most expensive shotgun in the game. The last one being the Crown and King, which for the record is full auto. So, um, you know, that says something. The, the Terminus is just not worth it unless you just get perks. And the main perk is weathering. GG, well played. Nothing as far as the eyes can see. ricochet.mp3 single kill that game but um yeah see i did not get enough for a full even guns mm -hmm. with the aftermath with two different bounties there in hunt points also i did get a kill on who one of the guys in the last team oh yes i killed the guy um coming down that little hill on the right yep did i happen to finish the terminus with that would be kind of cool. Would be kind of cool if I didn't have to use this piece of shit anymore. Nope, I got Spectre. Terminus? <laughs> Please. <laughs> Let me use something viable. Uh... Okay. Okay, we're going to take the most absolutely lethal loadout you've ever seen in your life. It's going to be two Terminus hand cannons. Oh, wait, no. I should have done that. Uh, this particular guy uh, no longer needs that uh, because there's a first extraction bonus on every character. So they um, you get more hunt coins and stuff if you don't, you know, if you use a variety of hunters, which is a cool way of incentivizing you to do that. I think they did really good on that. Uh, I just think that um, their game. Uh, is really unreliable and 
using uh, bad weapons is kind of stinky. Also, my game is uh, wigging out, so we're going to figure out what happens here. It might just crash. It might not. It might have just frozen for a little bit. got a connection error. We good? Connect with my voice? I can. Okay, I don't know what that was. I think that was something with the actual internet, not the, uh, my game has been crashing for the record, but it's not been an internet thing, I don't think. Um, so what I'm finding is that I'm quite lacking in people who have Terminus stuff going on. Uh, which would be a direct result of uh, me hating it. <laughs> this is what we're gonna do. One with penny shot, one with slugs. <laughs> I, I I really hate this weapon, and I'm putting two of them in the same fucking loadout. <laughs> it's just the the um, what do you call them? The full-size versions of these weapons, this particular one at least, is like barely usable with traits, and I'm using half-size versions without traits. It's just, it's not good. It's not good. Two bounties. Two bounties. Give us two bounties. Give me two ba ah. two piece. <laughs> this means all the teams will be contesting the same boss. And there's only two bounties to get out of it. But it uh, does equate to uh, the same amount as the other one. Like this one bounty will be worth two bounties in any other game. But... Um, that does not make it uh, fun for me. It's fine. Make it work. So two smacks to the face, and then one with the gun. <coughs> and I fear. There we go. Thank you. I do not want to set the crows off. I wonder if I can even do this. Alright. 
So up until now, I've been playing Hunters with Greyhound and Determination, both of them. Both of those traits uh, essentially make it so that your stamina regenerates uh, to a degree that is acceptable. Since I am not doing that right now, I'm a stamina shot with me. So now enemies uh, might know our location. There was a team that we know to our north. We may actually encounter them on our way to Fort Karmic here. Fort Karmic uh, is one of, I think, two, yeah, only two on this map uh, locations that can have two clues instead of one. Um, so, yeah, it tends to get a little hotly contested right about this point in the game when everyone's at one clue. Provided everyone's moving at a steady pace, um, this could get nasty. So this is gonna be a piece. Yep. Still here? Nope. Going to sleep though. Someone's gonna do this. The boss here. It's in a corner of the map that I guarantee someone spawned in. That's fine though. We can still conceivably win this if we kill them, but it's gonna suck no matter what we do here. That's just kind of how this is gonna work with a single bounty, you know. and not chase us for a little bit. <clears throat> this kind of sucks, doesn't it? Ah, oh, that guy was getting smart. He's going to the little bridge over there that I didn't even know existed. <laughs> He's not easy. Gotcha. I don't know if that's better or worse, but... get too aggressive, I can fucking finish up them. Otherwise, I might have to, you know, bank my, uh, my life on a sure shot with the slugs, which... There's another team to my east southeast by the way. I heard shots that way. So I'm kind of debating on whether or not it's even a good idea to push this. All four teams are here now. Oh no. And we are one of the two teams in the middle of the sandwich. At least I am. So that team must be the red boss. Nonetheless, not good. What to 
do. I want to get my teammate really bad, but I know that if I do, I'm gonna get shot by the team over there. Listen for where the enemies are. My teammate's probably gonna die over there. He's fighting two teams alone. I just can't do anything about that. He might even leave. I would not be surprised. His skull is no longer over there, so he's, he's left. I don't know what to do. With that person over there, maybe even having seen me, like, this gets so much more difficult. I hope they didn't actually see me and they were too focused. Maybe they'll even push across the water and get closer to me. I'll blast them. Okay, it's officially started, <laughs> uh, purely because that guy was just in the wrong place at the wrong time. I just gotta be careful, because that wasn't the guy that I possibly got seen by earlier. I, I want to get up there. unsure if I can that lady was she's not gonna let me just revive him I might be able to do some tricks here maybe if I work on it right now. I just don't think that'll work oh they were burning the other guy on my team that's not much of an issue The guy left. We have no obligation to fight these people. Well, she's gonna burn. I'm gonna burn right back. You know, I'm not the one playing with Longemo. I'm about to burn that body. Whenever you're done. Looting her for a consume or him for a consumable. And this person, unlike I, or unlike me, is obligated to fight us now. Unless that teammate left. So I may go back down to my little hidey hole down there. It's like this quite good. Quite a good spot. To even make it out of this alive would be a blessing at this point. I don't think we're gonna be able to get. Um I'm 
like that. She has a weapon that is viable for the situation. I do not. Know. and they're all going to me instead of the enemies there. All the enemies are the ones making noise, you know. Yeah. Ah, the AI in this game can be so unforgiving. <laughs> like, I was doing so okay there. Like, I, I stood a decent chance if they got close to me, and then all four of the dogs, it, it happened to be a pack of four, of course, and they went for me, despite the fact that I had made no noise. Because once they're aggroed, they just go for any players in the vicinity of them. It really sucks. It really does. But, you know, we got it. Terminus is done. That is all of the medium weapons now. The only weapons I have left are the three-slot weapons. Which I'm taking the mediums thing out of my notes in my phone now. So. Oh, shoot. Um, is there an undo thing? I can put it back in if needed, but... Alright, so the only uh, weapons that I now have to do are the normal carabiner, which is uh, what I'm actually going to use next, um, because it's really close to being done. The, um... Ooh, hold on, let's, uh, let's get a free point, maybe. Yeah. Yep, I'm aware. I actually might keep one of those scuff fields, I don't know why I took it off. Um, so I need to kill, with the normal carabiner, like, one dude. Um, and then uh, I need the big windfield, which is the uh, the M1 thing that was in the book alone. Uh, yeah, I, I, I'm really kind of disappointed that those uh, dogs decided to go for me despite not making any noise, but th there's just nothing I can do about it, you know? Games AI does what it does. Um, so I gotta do the normal carabiner, which I have them in order. Um, and then the big wind field, which actually is a 45. Uh, I have the percentages and everything in my book, or in my uh, note here. 45%. Uh, Sparks is at 65 instead of 43. 65%. Uh, Sparks Sniper, still at 77. LaBelle, 29. Actually at 32 now. 32%. LaBelle Aperture, 46. Uh, it's at 56. Uh, the LaBelle Talon is at 41. The LaBelle Marksman is at 57. The LaBelle Marksman is now at 68. Just one uh, point short of greatness. Uh, Berthier was at 32. It is now at 62. Sick. Um, the Berthier Deadeye was at 20. It is now at 40. Making some hella gains on the Berthier, it seems. Uh, Mosin is 29. It's at 37. Uh, the next one beneath it was at 45 and is now at 70. So, 37 and then 70. 37%. Mosin Bayonet. 70%. Uh, Mosin Sniper. Still at 42%. Aptomat, 43%. Nitro, 13. Nitro is at 14. Ooh. <laughs> I probably meleeed a single grunt and then got shot. <laughs> Whatever. Alright. Um, yeah, this is our boy. I'm not going to buy a large stamina shot, even though I prefer to have one of those. Uh, because he came with a small one, so why would I do that? Centennial. I'd like to see that. Ooh, you're using an interesting loadout. No melee weapon. Or, well, I guess that combat axe compensates, but poison ammos at least or poison arrows at least for the emulators no no i guess this guy just says fuck it my teammates will my teammates will deal with the emulators 
That's fine. I love to see someone actually running the combat axe. It's such a fun weapon. <laughs> That, that game didn't take too bo too long for a loss. Am I strong enough? Let things just die. Doggo, he's at the water bit. What the dog doing? Uh, let's have another go. Only one bounty. Cringe. Mm -hmm. Excuse me. that entirely, huh? Crossbow and bow bolts, though, um, these mechanics don't really come into play with players very often, because, um, for the most part, if you just, uh, hit someone with a throwing knife or axe or something like that, they are dead. The only one that's conceivable is probably a throwing knife. It's, uh, to the body, that won't kill, but just about everything else that you can pull out of an enemy will kill to the body. Throwing knives are one of the exceptions, and against particularly tanky enemies, uh, other ones will do as well. Like the armored, who take two throwing knives instead of one before you pull out and kill them. Grunts will only take one to the head. Um, they'll take two to the body before you have to, or they'll take one to the body before you have to pull out and kill. Uh, or before pulling out, will kill them. Let's get the uh, bounty first, or the boost. <laughs> I know 
Z bei der DN und Z bei der DN zu tun mit. See through that that window. Nothing. <laughs> Two things. Oh, I. I had a large health bar up front. I'll wait till I hear enemies before I use this. Here or see. There's a shot coming up there. That's a weird feel. That there was a rebel. That's a version this one. Uh, uh, dodge the teams. But, um, we're probably just gonna end up having to fight them. They'll probably make it here with no sweat. Sounds like that fight is mostly over anyway. Maybe. Some fights take long, sometimes they don't. It depends on how the people are playing. I was hearing quite a lot of shooting there, so... And the reason that I haven't opened the window on this side is because, um, well, if I do, right, there's good and bad parts of it. I can see better. I can see the enemies better whenever they come in. But if they see that it's open before I catch eye at wind of them, like I know where they are, they will just shoot me. Like, I, it's, it's unfavorable to peek out of windows in a first-person shooter game. Being out of the things just works like that it's like how in uh, PUBG they always talked about how um, third person favored uh, people outside or inside whereas first person favored the opposite so depending on your play style or your positioning you know one would benefit you more setting off a horse in that direction I heard that Try to dodge them. They're taking some time. <clears throat> if at all possible, I'd like to try to dodge the other teams.
teammate chuck the red barrels, be mindful. They're not in sight yet. We may be able to just steal away with this bounty while they're fighting. That's the hope, but um, it probably is not what's going to happen. As cool as it would be to not have to fight them at all. Get away with a win here for free. <laughs> It's just likely that they'll start running away from the other team, or maybe they'll even band up. I've had, I've, I've talked to enemies whenever enemies, teams were trying to escape with the bounty, and just been like, straight up, yo, the enemies are leaving with the bounty. Consider not fighting us, and then we'll fight after. <laughs> That's sort of, um, I don't want you to lose. I just don't want them to win mentality. You know what I mean? It fuels people. And that actually worked out quite well when I, when I did that off with the enemy team that one time. But that is the only time I've ever had that chance come up. So, yeah. It doesn't help that uh, for communication, the, the Voip in this game is like kind of close range. You do have to be within like a, a pretty small range to talk to your enemies, so. Sorry, man. He didn't. It just, well, it's, it's more like the, the carabiners fucking me in this way, but I was gonna say he just moved in such ways. It's not over yet, Anything but on. possibly GG. Anything on, on this? No, nothing on site yet. Still not. I would suggest the horses as cover though, because they are bulletproof. Yeah, they didn't even make it into the sight range, GG. They were too caught up with the other team. So for those guys, right, the ones who didn't get the bounty there, um, they get a five-minute countdown, and then if they're not off the map by that time, or at least at an extraction point at the time of that five minutes ending, they just lose. They lose their hunters, they lose their gear, everything. <clears throat> Hey man, we'll take that. Did that give me progress in the logbook? Probably not enough. I didn't kill like anything with my uh my what you call it? Carabiner. I might run this guy again. Uh I want to, but I probably won't. I say these words and I'm lying when I say these words. Um It has to do with the fact that I'm like I I, I am dead set on getting those um first extraction bonuses every day for as many characters as possible because they give me more hunt coins or hunt dollars and um i need hunt dollars to do the um like i need to be storing them up for whenever i have to do that grind with the long ammo weapons which are super expensive um you just got great i like that i'm gonna go as well um, what was I trying to say? But, yeah, like, I, I, I'm i gonna have to slog my way through all of the heavy ammo weapons, or long ammo weapons. And whenever I do that, I'm going to need a lot of um, hunt coins to compensate for how much I'm going to be spending on the weapons themselves whenever I lose. Um, so it's kind of a meh situation right now like i i noticed that like i didn't replace this guy's weapon i will still buy like hunters that have good traits from the recruitment tab but i will not like go out of my way to to spend money on things that are extravagant i mean i was spending a lot even so on like slugs and just in general special ammo for the hand cannons because they are uh, <laughs> shitty without it. <clears throat> Let's see how it goes. Oh. 
stretch. Knuckle pops. It's gamer time. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Right. And I'm gonna go get food at some point here. I might go up to the the McDonald's down there. Cause um, they're gonna be the only place that's open by the time I get done with this uh, objective of mine to get nine bounties. So. Do -do 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 -do. I kept my position in Gold League on Duolingo. Sick. Alright. I'm not gonna do all of this lesson, but... Uh, she has a Finnish phone. She has a Finnish cell phone. A Finn in Estonian. Uh, Sumalainen Javirolainen. I am a Dane. Or Olet, you are a Dane. Sorry, I was like, where are the I am? There would be an N on that. Okay. Okay. So that's another thing about this game that I like a lot, is that you can just kind of shift your weapons around by just holding the button slot for uh, the other weapon. Yeah, I, I know why my teammate was going left there, by the way. This is a very, very contention... Or, this is a contested point, like, where I spawn sometimes. It just feels like being that way. It will spawn the teams extremely close to one another. Which, uh, I'm learning to look around a lot whenever I first spawn in. Because, um... Everyone else does, and if I'm not doing so, I get put off guard and shot in the back. So. And even though I could easily deal with those with the dusters, I'm explicitly meleeing them with my weapon to get XP for it, so that even if I die before I shoot a single hunter, which would, by the way, get me all the way to full, um, I get some XP. Maybe I'll get through all the way. I. It takes quite a few melees to uh, achieve that. You have to kill special um, enemies to make some real progress towards it. Which, unfortunately, um, is just not really in the abilities here. We're going for number two, which is down. My teammates seem to be going east towards... Ah, he's going to the supply point. I see this. Okay. There's a supply point for this thingy on the map. It's got ammo, it's got um, a toolbox guaranteed, it's got special ammo guaranteed. No, they look like they're not. They're they're going to the other bounty. I don't think I understand. I already used my stamina shot, so I can take from the toolbox here. Get, uh, I think I just got the Hellfire Bomb there. That's pretty good. I don't know what my teammates are doing. But we're not going for our bounty. They're signing us up for a fight with two other people, two other teams, I think. I mean, I get it. You know, you want PvP, but... Meh. I already got the job done. So I don't need to do that. I have no second. No secondaries left. I have no mediums now as well. All I have to get kills with and XP with is the main weapons. Oh, and another thing about the carabiner here. Um, because I'm using the base one, it's got um, a second layer to its uh, logbook, which the other ones don't have. So. Right now, I'm at one out of two. The other ones are just a one. Like, I, I just get to 100% and then they're done. This one's got two layers to it. There's a toolbox behind that shed if you need some uh, access. Here. Okay. 
Maybe this wasn't such a bad decision. <coughs> well, it probably wasn't such a bad decision, but... At least we can fight two teams. We can fight two teams at the boss lair. So we won't then have to walk. Oh, <coughs> that's gonna hurt. Yep. I did not realize that there was no ground there. I definitely thought that was an elevator there, though. kid here, and then I'm going to look around for an axe before I go in, because uh, the assassin here, the guy we're chasing down, uh, he is uh, particularly, uh, well, not he's not weak to the axe, but it stun locks him a little better than most of the other weapons do. I don't know if I can apply this now. Get a... Uh, <laughs> We can get that. Uh, ooh, here's an axe. Sick. I'll go ahead and get the uh, the assassin done. I got an axe, so. Right. Let's have a go, fucker. And another thing about the stamina shot, this axe, one swing of it, takes about half of your stamina normally. So, well, that's a little, you know, not as effective as the stamina shot. With the help of my teammate, we stun locked him entirely. I didn't have to chase him down a little bit at all. So. Okay, I'm putting an alert line on the barrel inside of the lair. Do not walk over it. So that uh, combo, if someone walks over that um, barrel, they will, or that alert line, they will just die. Whoever's got that dolch out there is cleaning the house, man. It's two kills for them. I may see if I can't trap any more red barrels. Since they're coming from that side, both teams are. One here, for sure. Uh, it'll do. Sucks the placement, but I too much about that. Oh fuck, 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 I'm dead. I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead. Ah. <laughs> I should 100% be dead, by the way. I think I'm grateful that. I think what I have to be grateful for is that that guy uh, fucked up his, or well, he didn't fuck up a second shot. He didn't get a second shot because there was an AI attacking him. That's locked. Can you um, go on the other side? for much longer if I keep using this thing. Seems like there's more than just two teams here and that's very bothersome. But... Bit of fluid movement there through the compound. We're going to realize that guy again. Probably not, he's going to help his team over there. Is. 
<laughs> get fooled. Get tricked, you buffoon. You buffoon. Oh no. I only need one bounty. I could just run away. Like, <laughs> that'd be kind of cheese, though. And I'm not gonna do that. Yeah, I'm not gonna leave my teammates for this fucking objective of mine. This made-up objective. I'm good on that. I'm not an asshole. <laughs> yeah, there's two of them in there. I wouldn't push. One has a rival as well. There's one kind of uh, southwest of the compound, southwest of our teammate, so more like 220 for us. They're so low as well, we should still load them or single them out. Oh no, they're with their team now. On the left. I wonder if that team's going to try to make off with that single bounty. It'd be kind of funny if they did that instead. Of I really miss that? I'm, uh, people who want to get in to save my life. Hello, who's this? It's, it's me, Gig. Hi, Nolan. Uh, I am currently playing some hunt uh, and recording it on OBS, so you're on candid camera. Uh, boner. Let's see. You're welcome for that one. I'll send you my invoice later. For, for the money. Yeah. That would cost. Uh, I'm, I don't think I can one shot this guy at this range. I should not fight this range. Oh, yeah. You guys are doing DD today, aren't you? What's up, gamers? How uh, much? Man, I really need to turn you down. You're gonna fucking blow audio levels out of the roof on OBS. Um. Hi, Blaine. Uh, we are, um, currently, well, I am playing Hunt and <laughs> recording it on OBS. And nice! Nolan oh, is, you. uh, here to say, uh, profane words. Poopy, stinky, doo-doo, shitbox, 360. I am just now leaving my mother's place, and I had to, I had to forcefully leave. That's interesting. Right, I gotta die yeah. real quick. I'm gonna pretty good at sight, and I would like to go over here. Ooh, Berthier, I need progress on that. I have gotten progress for the carabiner. I'm gonna take this Berthier and try to get two, two weapons progress. <laughs> <laughs> or I'm gonna get shot in the face from the side. You know, whatever works. I mean, good shot on their part, I guess. I think this is uh, going to go poorly. I don't think we're going to win this. Yeah, that guy the, the... <laughs> What are you doing? They walked into that one. And yeah, this guy right here, fucking Bobby does. He got two of us there. Uh, one shot each. Good job. Alright. Uh, Noya, ya, Roxy. Uh, then, yeah. Suomalainen on velhoja, norjalainen on viikinki. Yeah, norjalainen on viikinki. Missä norjalainen on? Norwegian, Unknown, unknown. Why is he unknown? I... Oh wait, no, I don't. Um... Did I get that by any chance? I did. Sick. 
Alright, no longer need to use the carabiner. <laughs> Let's see how that has two out of two instead of one out of one. That's how it is on the normal variant of every weapon in the game. So like this one, the windfield, the big one, that's at one of two because I already got the first one. The sparks is at one of two because I already got the first one. The label, one of two because I already got the first one. Berthier, one of two because I already got the first one. Mosin, one of two because I already got the first. Like it's, there's nothing I can do. Uh, nitro as well, though the nitro doesn't have any variants at all, so whatever. <laughs> all right. Cool. Where is the Norwegian instrument? Right. I have a good uh, cell phone. Uh, Iceland is a quiet country. Mika uh, Han on Hanska, which is uh, he is Danish. A Dane. Uh, Norway is Noria. Not an H, it's a J. There we go. Um. Oh man, I really just want to. I just want to use that gun right there. I think I'm going to take a break from the logbook. I've gotten progress on two different. Or, well, I've completed three different things today. I think I did my job for today. I'm going to have a little fun with a weapon that I enjoy for a little bit because, um,. It's a really good loadout just for starting out. Like it's amazing. So, <laughs> you know, I'm gonna I'm gonna have fun with this one. That's how I feel. I'm pulling out the big guns. Where is the liquid fire bomb? Oh, I'm right there. All right. Let's give it a go. So Springfield here uh, is another one of those one-shot weapons. It's got one shot in the clip, and it's got about 400 bullet velocity with the uh, Dum Dum Ammo that I usually use. It's honestly my favorite gun in the game. So that's uh, that's something, I guess. Uh, car is Auto. The green car is big. What did I spell wrong? Oh. <laughs> I, I was saying is big, and I put is iso. It's not on iso. Islanti on kulma ma. I can't type. Uh, Finland and um, what is uh, or sorry, a Finn and a. An Estonian. I I did and Vero Linen. What is going on? Misa uh Venaya on where is Russia? Gotcha. Auto on ISO. Auto on ISO. Suoma linen ya Vero Linen. Ya Not and Speaking Finnish. <laughs> right. Lanchette. This is one of the only uh, things in the game, by the way, that has um, two clues and is also something you can spawn next to. But uh, as a result of that, it's pretty dang highly contested. So um, I usually come in expecting a fight on this particular one. Phone down, but I'm trying to uh, get through all the menu on on Duolingo at the moment. There we go. See, just in time. Maybe I could have been shot there from that, uh, that straight way there. Between the trees. Yeah, I do Duolingo daily back. They are your friends. What am I hearing? 
swear to God I was hearing something on my right there. I had... Mama... Good schizo. Oh, both the clues are like, they're gonna last out of Still pretty happy with that. Uh, oh fuck! I was gonna say I'm still pretty happy that uh, my alert mine in the last game killed somebody. Can we get on top of that? It would seem not. I don't like that my teammates are choosing to go inside here. That's not a clever idea. Probably scared of the sparks, but I might catch them off guard by insisting to go this way. Let's see. three very very suddenly I missed that. Ooh, good shot wow that was very close I'm pretty sure he was in the air there though which makes it luck based but Whatever. I, I just, I'm not lucky as a person. That sure didn't go well. It might have gone better if I wasn't using the marksman scope, but uh, it was using Springfield marksman and I had to use the scope. Um, I don't like these hunters. So I'm gonna get a legendary one. They come with uh, no weapons, but they come with a trait or three traits. So you know, kind of okay. Pitcher magpie salve skin. Okay, interesting. Let's go with pitcher. Find my bundle. Ooh, Kazutina. There's this one. Gary. Alert mines. Stoplops. Alright, we were actually done with all the medium weapons as well in my notes here. Um, the only things that I need now that aren't long ammo are the. Uh, Nitro and the big wind field. So we'll do the big wind field. Oh, okay. I need to work on some of these long ammo ones. <laughs> as much as it pains me to use them. Um, go with the Deadeye uh, variant of the Berthier. Get that out of the way. Um, I'm at, oh, well, I'm at 40%. Probably not out of the way, but I'll get some progress sorted. And we'll bring an uppercut for uh, extra ammo. We're now back in four stars because I've been getting my ass beat. So. Uh, that's nothing new. I, I don't belong in five-star lobbies. It just continues to put me in them because um, I overperform in four stars every once in a while. <laughs> I, I can't believe that guy hit that shot. That was such a, a, a that was a clutch play on his part. Like it it saved him because I, I had him dead to rights with that explosive. But he, if he did not kill me there with that single shot he took, he was dead. And, I mean. Ha, <laughs> 
<laughs> right. Sulfur's pork. This is another one. Right? Like, on all the spawns, you, you, you kind of have to be aware of enemies, but this one is another one that I've noticed I've been having a lot of recently. They'll appear right down that road. Usually, if they're not also being observant in a normal tactile way, or tactile way, or they'll go around the side instead. <laughs> okay, you just did not get a damn about them ducks. Is going in. Alright, alright, I support it. I'm pretty down, I just can't participate in the uh, wild uh, shenanigans with the ground because we're not going to see them long enough. And uh, I'm, I need all the ammo to get with me. Attempting stealth. Failing stealth. <laughs> yeah, I'm totally down to just have a fight. You know, get a chance to use this breath of the air. Probably die in the process, but, you know, get some XP for the gun. I'm totally down with that. Which, the breath of the air is probably the most unusable of the guns. Personally, um, or actually, no, the Nitro is definitely the worst. But, uh, of the guns I have left, I dislike the Birth Gear quite a lot. Which, the reason the Nitro sucks, uh, you'll probably, I might even show off later, if, or, well, next game, if, uh, we don't win this one. <laughs> even if we win this one, I might still do it. Um, I'm being shot at now from behind me. That's crazy. Oh my god! <laughs> Get bodied! <laughs> oh, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die. Okay, it's fine. <laughs> Just annihilated their teammate there, man. See ya. Give me another, give me another, give me another juicy headshot. Destroyed that girl. Can't believe that. Is she still dead? Uh, yes, she is. Oops, she's there. Okay. Oh, there's one that I did not see that is still shooting at me. Um, I still didn't see him. I, oh, there he is. Where are you shooting at me from? Or, uh, may I? Kill this? How close is this guy? I'm not aiming until I see him because the dead eye can fuck me. Oh my god! Oh! I am popping off! Probably necro her, and I think better. So I probably need to watch out for that. The issue with doing so is that it requires me to uh, be within line of sight of her, which is difficult. Okay. Okay. Am I a 
have been a whole new team. Girl. Though I doubt it. I need to have, like, mostly full health, by the way, because that Sparks can do up to 149 damage on a body shot. Which, uh, my max health is 150, by the way. So. Let's see that. Sounded very close. I don't know. Spicy in the corner. There, in that shack there. Blanking, that's gonna be hard set that emulator off. We'll see what they do about that. But they might just do it themselves if they start to shoot at someone from that side. I can't believe I hit that fucking first shot, man. That was sick. They just got annihilated. Let's see if I can see this. Oh, I can't. Is anyone upstairs to this place? Third is our Sparks. Oh, there's a, another team coming in. That's not good. Alright. We will face them with the same uh, vigor and brutality that we did that last team. Actually, now that I think about it, that might have been... I thought there was a difference in their shirts, but I thought the guy that was uh, shooting at my teammates from up here was male. That is the whole team. When I think about it. It's just us and this team with this trigger hammer levering guy. I mean, awful close to me, despite presumably having no idea that I'm even here. I don't know how the hell you knew I was here. Oh, is this a bounty team? Ah, yeah, that'll explain it. Because they got literal wall hacks. In game, supported. My teammates are abandoning me. <laughs> I need to get to the cover now. But yeah, if I stayed there, I'd just get surrounded by three enemies and then die. I needed to move back, even though it's kind of cringe and cowardly. But my teammates are cringe and cowardly, and I have to be part of the team, so. Where the fuck are you people going? Are you just not in the mood to fight? Like, hello? I thought we were fighting these dudes. And my teammates, who have not gone down yet and are not missing bars, are just running. Like... Hello? We, we have to fight them, right? I don't know, they're sitting in the parish for no reason. They're actually not even inside. They're just out in the middle of the road there. In the, of the street. Mm -hmm. I gotta wonder what my teammates are doing. I, I wanna know what's going through their heads. Like, I, uh, we have to shoot these people to get their bounty. That's that's part of the game. I don't know. I mean, I would think that is in our intentions. But, uh, maybe we're going around to stop them from going to the... They're going to the other bounty. Boys, those guys aren't even coming this way. They're going to the other bounty. I think that guy just... That third squad. Did they get wiped? Uh, the, the, the first squad that we saw, we shot all three of them, yes. But, uh, I don't know what's happening with the, the last team. I'd assume they're on the side that the bounty team's going to. Yeah, I guess let's go for them then. I think our teammates want to extract. Like, the, the other bounty, it's like, they're going for the double. 
Like, I have no idea what this guy's motives are, but, like, this was such a stupid play. Like, <laughs> kind of unbelievable. I don't understand. <laughs> There's just no reason for it. This guy just gave up the chance at the bounty because he wants to play passive. I mean, there's no winning now. We have to catch them and also kill the other team. Like, it's just not going to happen. I'm in max ammo now. Excuse me. Where's my body over here? So I did headshot this person then. I thought I did. Where are they at? Where is your corpse? Bring out your dead. It wasn't this one. Maybe there was another one over, I think. I want to loot this, uh, this body, though. Oh, that's a ladder. Right here? Right there. Yeah. I was wondering why her shirt was, like, a different color the second time I saw her. After I killed her. <laughs> I just don't think we're going to catch this team. I think my teammate totally fucked us by um, making the decision, but I, it's it can happen. I mean, we could conceivably still win this. The problem is that that bounty team is really good. I could tell just by their movement they're good players. And, like, when someone plays that aggressively, you know, you, you know they're good. And I like that. I like whenever I'm facing enemies who play aggressive because there's a chance that, you know, I can have a decent fight. And then my teammates just, like, they just walked away. And I'm not going to fight a whole trio of decent players on my own, so. You know, here we are. I'm going to be using this instead. This, this place will probably be pretty clear of AI. I'm going to look around for barrel traps, though. Far north. They might try to be. They might be trying to extract block. Yeah, that's what it looks like. They're blocking the extract for the other bounty, which is good. Good tactic. Um, I'm gonna try to flank around on their uh, east side. Um, and I guess I'm gonna do so solo because I don't have teammates that are uh, willing to uh, join me. They are going directly towards the other bounty, like that's going to accomplish something. Um. I don't know. Is this that, uh, yeah. Maybe they didn't hit this. I, I doubt it, though. They probably... Ooh. Well, they hit it, but they didn't even use any of the consumable things. Sick. I got another dynamite stick. I have four different lethal throwables. <laughs> That's my consumables. Come on. Come on. Moving to stop these bounties. Sorry about that. Kind of forgot you guys were here. Um, <laughs> I got a little caught up in uh, doing the advertiser voice, entertaining the fans. Oh, my game is uh, frozen now. This is not good. I hope nothing is attacking me when I get back. Out of vain. Hello. good um so currently we're chasing down uh a bounty team uh well we're bounty extract blocking anyway um which is okay i i don't really like being on this side of the the equation i hate being the guy that sits at the extract waiting for the bounty to move 
but you know, whatever. There's uh, three different enemies holding the bounty. Do that means there are. Oh, it could be that every one of that first trio that we were fighting there has a bounty, or it could be that uh, both teams are holding a bounty. But uh, we basically bodied a team, and then the bounty team in our area came our way to try to fight us. And my teammate decided that he would just, like, run away from them. So, obviously, uh, the other two of us joined him. And uh, that bounty team just decided to move on to the next bounty. And another team started the banishment as they were moving towards them. And we are now fighting that other team, I think. So it would appear, anyway. This is just not a favorable position. I hate... I hate this, I hate this, I hate this, I hate this. I hate. And all three of them are just kind of chilling over that, on that side. My teammates are not going to get aggressive here, which is kind of frustrating. Are they even using sniper variants? One of them is using a normal-ass fucking Springfield, and they're playing like this? Your gun is designed for medium range, and you're playing, like, way over that. <laughs> uh, my gun's designed for long range, and I'm playing pretty dang aggressive. You know, I like having fun. I like shooting my bad enemies. The bad guys. Are they leaving? No. But they did back up to that other roof, I think. that angle. There is one in there. that doesn't have the bounty. My teammate just bodied them. Oh no, they had the bounty. <sighs> My teammate just walked in through this door, so it must be open. Fucking Winfield today, that's how I feel. Forced him to move positions with that concertina, which is good. Unfortunately, it doesn't do anything for us because now they're just playing passive again. We need to burn that body, but I don't. Ah, here's a lantern. <laughs> Summon one as you say it. Alright, where's that? Uh, you. Throwable, please. Please, how about you? Stamina shot. I mean, that's not too bad. I'll, I'll use it whenever we leave. I if we leave. Yeah. <laughs> 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 
I missed that shit? Oh my god, I <laughs> Wobble wobble goop. Wobble goop. Wobble wobble goop. Wobble wobble goop. Yo, playing around here sounds like crazy Dave. I just heard him charge my ally. You did not, shut up. Damn it! <laughs> <laughs> oh man, okay. Hi, Blaine. Hi. Welcome back. I was literally fighting three people and trying to listen, and you just come in wobble bugaba goop like shut up. Okay, you're in a voice chat. <laughs> like, I don't know. What do you expect from us? We're literally retards. Whoa. Sorry, I entered a voice chat and started talking. <laughs> you started talking nonsense. I wouldn't care if you were saying, like, hi, hello. You're just saying nonsense. Like It's funny, it's funny though. I disagree. <laughs> Nolan didn't, and uh, majority rules, so it was two out of three. Democracy, fucker. <laughs> oh, this one has to rival points. Okay. Whoa, whoa. whoa. Crazy Dave. Crazy Dave. Hey, there you go. Excuse me. My game froze again. Awesome. Sick. Like how I messaged Patrick to make sure you were playing it. start doing D, D in the wrong fucking channel we're not doing D, D yet though we're not intending to do D, &D in here D, D hasn't started yet everybody's not here yeah, so we're relaxing chatting playing games i think i'm quite good on this all right uh medium slot I don't know what I want to use here.
All right. Yeah, I'll be honest with the um, leaving there, that was kind of abrupt, kind of rude, but um, it doesn't make for good content when I'm sitting here arguing with one of my friends on the fucking camera, so I think I'm good on that, you know what I mean? I also didn't end up making my goal here, uh, ultimately, because my teammates just fucking walked into a person with levering like they could just survive the barrage of bullets. Despite the fact that they did not have close range weapons, my teammates were just severely misunderstood on how to use the weapons and their design ranges, and that upsets me, but... And I, I mean, they were four stars, you know? They're, they're not expected to be... Savants. I just, I'm upset over other things as well. You know, I'm mostly upset over my goal, but I'm not about to also, you know, ruin all this fucking three plus hours of content that I've had here, because Blaine just feels like he wants to argue today. Like, you know, I get the whole, like, yeah, you're in a Discord chat, you know, we can join and talk, that's the entire purpose of you sitting in your chat. That's fair. The issue with it that I take is that, you know, they literally are about to do D&D, &D, which they know that I leave for every time, because I don't, you know, it's either I sit there deafened, and then every once in a while I'm deafened to speak to them, or I just don't deal with all that stress, you know? And if they're about to do D&D &D anyway, I don't know why they would join the voice chat that I'm in, because I'm in a different channel than they do that. They literally have a channel in the Discord server I'm in for D&D. Like, it's just how it works, man. You know, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna sit here and waste my time arguing. The whole goal of this has been to, you know, create content for the YouTube channel, and you know, it's working. I, mean, I still got some pretty good content. I had a really good time with this. I, I didn't succeed the challenge, which was to get 9 before uh, 10.30, but... You know, whatever. I might give myself, like, a buzzer rule sort of thing, where I, um... I can get another win. Or if I can get another win, like, right now, on the last one that I started before 10.30, it's fine. I don't know why he's shooting. Is there enemies, or did he just shoot to, to shoot? It seems like he just shot to shoot, because there's nobody... He levered an enemy just now. better with the bow. So, I pulled it out because I'm in a stressful situation. Oh. Pains, man. Ah. Yeah, I'm dead. Uh. My 
my teammate just he just walked into him, man. It's, it's kind of upsetting to me that they do that. They play the way they do. I'm gonna die here. This guy's made a mistake in doing this. This is like the worst spot to fucking raise me in I've ever seen. Okay, well I got out somehow, so take it, I guess. I thought I died of that, right? I closed my eyes. more I had to pull out the bow I have no choice I'm not sure how good of an angle I've got here I know I'm looking for a cane now Of that. You know how I feel about it? Watch your blood, bitch. New team, new team. I'll use this now, because otherwise it goes to waste. If I just die, so. At least now I feel like I kind of put it to good use, maybe. I'm gonna die if I hold still here. I have to keep moving. So I don't know where their third is, or their second even. I hope my teammate's seeing all of them, but. I don't like this position. Our teammates just leaving us. They're nothing new, you know. All of my teammates are cowards, so. And we have to move forward to progress, so.
guess that would happen. And we're sitting here occupied by this team for eight years. I'm gonna go around to the other side of Sweet Bell and not fighting them from this side. Because if we fight them from this side, we'll have to get sandwiched at some point. That's definitely at me, right? Maybe I'm the teammates, maybe. If I'm fortunate. Because where I am, I just die. I shoot him anyway. I just don't I want my team to, to work with this, work towards the Spanish. The Spanishing team needs to die. I don't know, maybe I'm the one confused. I just don't want to let them go. Like, oh man, my teammates are gonna die to that second team. I shouldn't have gone this far. I thought my teammates were with me, and I just, I was just, I'm confused. That's all. Misguided. I might be able to help my team at some point. Here. He's going for a revive. Maybe they got them all. I don't know. It looks like they're going to loot. I mean. Is that all three of this team? Go. We need to stop that other team. We have to fight those things. Try to get eyes on them. Can't. They can't dodge us. We're too close now. And there's one in the fucking window there, of course. And we're not actually zoomed in on it. game sometimes. Okay, okay, okay. It's fine. Have they left? They're sitting in the building. Good.
please. Fucking wigging out over there, which is really annoying. What? I don't know why they're playing like this. They're gonna get me killed doing it though, that's for sure. For what reason are we backing off? Are we just taking a single bounty and calling it good? Wow, okay. Cowards, man. I guess. I mean, I'll take it. It's a win. That gets me at 9 today, if we're doing the buzzer rule. It's just super lame. Like, you go for the server wipe. You know what I mean? You go for it. It's just... You just gotta. I get it. You know, I get they don't want to lose the characters, and they, they, you know, they've got something to lose. I'm just using the fucking legendary hunter that I just bought. But I mean, all of my kills were not even with the um, what you call it, Labelle here. I got three or four kills here, I think, and all of them were with the bow or the axe there. I mean, I got the more expensive arrows off that guy. <laughs> if there's any uh, consolation. No, I'd rather we just extract if we're already moving. I mean, they can try to t chase us, but they probably won't catch us. They'll probably come our way, though. They'll come chasing. Cases they may, they will not catch us. I'm not sure what that one was doing that came rushing out of us. Were they trying to melee us with a knife? What a decision. A stupid one. You had the bounty and everything, but... Whatever. A win where I can get it. I don't know how vis visible we are here. I only killed two there. I thought I killed three. No, I'll take that, man. Any day of the week, we'll take that. Alright, I think we're gonna end off here. I'm gonna upload this much. Um, I got my nine win thing, if you count the bell buzzer thing. Um, you know, I, I would be down to do this again at some point. Give myself a different goal next time. 
Um, I guess I'll see y'all later. I didn't listen to any music, so I don't actually have to fuck with the description on this one. That's kind of interesting. Um, I can't seem to find 100 hands. There it is. <laughs> um, yeah. Games, I suppose. Which I think I recorded throughout the entirety of my blood offerings here, so... That's a good time to end it. I'm not gonna get the assassin kills today, probably. I'm probably not gonna play this game for a little while today. So, it's been good. Um, thank you for watching, if anyone ever did. Uh, it wasn't really a stream, it was more of a recording. But we'll still call it a uh, stream. I don't know. Bye.